Hello traders, welcome back to Pips Traders YouTube channel. Today we are going to be doing technical analysis in US 30. As usual, I will be doing the analysis in daily time frame to 5 minutes time frame and we will be sharing you the trend of the market and the support and resistance levels. Please use it as a reference for deciding on your entry and exit on your trades. Let us start with the analysis. I am in daily time frame now. When we look at the price action in daily time frame, it was on a very nice bullish trend trading within a bullish channel pattern and from here you can notice it started moving on a sideways rather than going on a continuous bullish trend and it broke this support level of bullish channel pattern which it was trading in previously and when we closely analyze the current price action we can notice that it started moving on a sideways and also I have drawn the channel pattern over here which is the resistance line and I have drawn a support line over here which is acting as a very strong support line or the trend line and the price action is still moving on a very nice sideways the lowest it has gone was 33119 and the highest it has gone was 36958 so the current price action is trading between this support and resistance level it has not made new high or it has not made new lows. It is on a sideways for now. And also we have the trend line or the support line, the green color line, which is actually representing the trend of the current market. As long as US 30 is moving above this green line, we can expect the bullish trend reversal to happen. And currently you can notice that it is actually rightly crossing this support level of 33119 if it breaches this support level we can expect a bearish trend reversal in us 30 and next level of support in daily time frame is going to be around 29685 so within this range bound market also this midline is acting as a divider between the bullish trend and the bearish trend currently the price action is moving below this midline so only when the price action breaks this resistance line we can expect the bullish trend to start. Previously the price action used to take support on this trend line or the support line from the channel pattern and lately we have noticed that price action has taken attempts to break this support line and you can also notice that there is a red color candle being found below this support line. So we can expect a further fall in this currency pair and to test the 33119. But still it is only a retracement, it is not a bearish trend reversal. Only when the price action breaks this trend line or the support line, we can say that bearish trend reversal has happened. Let us do the analysis in 4 hours time frame. I am in 4 hours time frame now. When we look at the price action in 4 hours time frame, we have the daily time frame channel pattern resistance line running over here and also the support line running over here. And also we have the trend line or the support line from the daily time frame running over here and the current price action is trading above this support line or the trend line. So currently it is only on a retracement not a bearish trend reversal. Since the price action is trading within this resistance level and the support level you can notice that whenever the price action tests this resistance level it retraces in a trend. Then it breaks this resistance level then goes on a bullish trend then retraces and takes support on this trend line or the support line again it goes on a bullish trend retests this resistance line from the bullish channel pattern again falls on a bearish trend reversal it has formed a weeks to test this trend line or the support line but major portion of the price action took place at the support line of the bullish channel pattern from the daily time frame and went on a bullish trend and it couldn't break this midline of the bullish channel pattern. Currently, the price action is in a bearish trend reversal and taking support on this previous trend line or the support line. But looking at the past price action, we have noticed that whenever the price action tests this support line or the trend line, it bounces back on the bullish trend. So currently also it is taking support on this trend line or the support line so there are more chances that it will bounce back on the bullish side or even if the price action doesn't take support on this trend line 
we can expect it to trend down take support on the higher time frame support level which is around 33096 overall when we analyze the price action in 4 hours time frame it is trading on a sideways there is no new high or there is no new lows being formed it is a sideways market so if the price action takes this support level of 33096 we can expect a bullish trend reversal and go on a bullish trend to we test on the resistance level of 36953 it is a range bound market for now only when the price action breaches this resistance level or the support level we can expect a directional market to start let us mark the support and resistance levels for 4 hours time frame so the values within this red color boxes are the support and resistance levels for 4 hours time frame and currently also you can notice that it is taking support at the 70% retracement level of fibonacci tool there are more chances that price action will take support at this level and have a bullish trend reversal let us do the analysis in hourly time frame i mean hourly time frame now when we analyze the price action in hourly time frame whenever the price action takes this support line or the trend line you can notice that there is a consolidation being happening then a bullish trend reversal happened again it has consolidated at the mid line of the bullish channel pattern and sort of consolidation happened then a bearish trend reversal has taken place so looking at the past price action before making any long move it always makes a consolidation so wait for it to consolidate over here also mark the ranges in which it is consolidating whenever it breaks this resistance level or the support level you can go on a directional trade but i am expecting a bullish trend reversal to happen because it has already tested this support level over here and whenever it tests this support level we have noticed bullish trend reversal happening so we can expect a similar pattern to be repeated in coming price actions also let us mark the support and resistance levels so the values within this red color boxes are the support and resistance levels for hourly time frame currently the price action is in a very nice downtrend and taking support on this support level of 33967 let us do the analysis in 30 minutes time frame i am in 30 minutes time frame now as we know from the hourly time frame currently the price action has taken support on this support line or the trend line from the past price action and currently i have drawn a channel pattern also bearish channel pattern from where it was taking support and it has broken this support line momentarily and has gone on a bullish trend again it has retested on this support line and if the bearish trend still continues we can expect it to retest on this trend line or the support line and to bounce back on the bullish trend you can go on a bullish side trade once it breaches this resistance line from the bearish channel pattern and more confirmation comes only when it breaks this resistance line or the trend line once it breaches this trend line we can confidently go on a bullish side trade let us mark the support and resistance levels so the values in red color boxes are the support and resistance levels in 30 minutes time frame currently the price action has tested this resistance line from the bearish channel pattern and it went on a bearish trend again took support on this trend line from the daily time frame and bounced back again it is on a retracement wait for it to break this resistance level of 34479 to actually go on a bullish side trades let us do the analysis in 5 minutes time frame when we look at the price action in 5 minutes time frame it always forms a double bottom or double top pattern before making a trend reversal so wait for it to make similar pattern so that you can confidently go on a directional trades currently when we notice a price action it is in a bearish trend i am expecting it to take support on this bearish channel pattern support line or the trend line then to bounce back on the bullish side the first level of resistance is going to be the bearish channel pattern resistance line only when it breaks this resistance line we can expect a proper bullish trend to start let us mark the support and resistance levels so the values within this red color boxes are the support and resistance levels for 5 minutes time frame currently the price action is in a very nice bearish trend i am expecting it to take support on this trend line then to go on a bullish side trade wait for it to 
retrace and retest on this support level of 33973 then wait for a break on this trend line or the support line then you can go on a bullish side trade if the price action breaks this support level you can go on a bearish side trades the levels are given in 30 minutes time frame please follow those levels when you are trading on a bearish side trades thank you for watching this video if you have found this video to be useful press that like button and if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to get a regular notification on my video updates.